Welcome back. Let's focus on Adani Enterprises. The stock is up nearly 5% after Cantor Fitzgerald initiates coverage with an overweight rating on the stock. Armas joins in with the details on Adani Enterprises as an entity. Armas. You know, pretty bullish commentary coming in from Cantor Fitzgerald on Adani Enterprises. But before we get to that, we'll tell you something more about Adani Enterprises as a whole. And it is the flagship company, as we know, of the Adani Group. And it was the first one from the group to be listed in 1994. And it is engaged in the mix of establishing and incubating businesses. And from then, once the businesses start to run, they demerge those businesses as separate entities. Now, since its own listing in 1994, Adani Enterprises has incubated multiple businesses and has managed to list six of them independently, primarily the being Adani Ports, Adani Power, Adani Energy Solutions, Adani Green, Adani Total Gas, and Adani Wilmar. And in all of these companies, it holds close to from around 56% stake to around 88% stake, which is the highest in Adani Wilmar. And uh, since then, the six independent entities that they have managed to list all the uh, over the years. Now, Adani Enterprises itself has a market cap of around 3.5 lakh crore, but all the listed companies, barring Adani Wilmar have a market cap in excess of 1 lakh crore rupees. Now, the six independent companies that they have managed to list now have a total combined market cap of over 10 lakh crore rupees. So, th this is excluding Adani Enterprises, of course. Not uh, This is just the six companies that they have. Now, what has Cantor Fitzgerald said on Adani Enterprises? They have initiated coverage with an overweight rating and a price target of 4,368, which is a potential upside of 50% from Thursday's closing price. Now, what they are saying with regards to the business spin-off is the fact that the businesses that they have spun off has a combined market cap of $156 billion. And the ability to identify future trends will continue to ensure that Adani Enterprises acts as a differentiator in the coming decades as well. And that, the, and that several businesses from the current portfolio can also be spun off going forward. Now, the potential business spin-offs that they are anticipating include the airports business, the data center JV that they have with Edge Connects and the energy ecosystems business which also includes the solar, wind and the electrolyzers portfolio as well. Now what they are valuing these businesses, they are valuing the airports business at around 1620 rupees, the solar, wind and the electrolyzers business at over 1500 rupees and the data center business is what they are uh, 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 valuing at around 31 rupees a share. But it's a pretty bullish report on Adadi Enterprises overall. Uh, stock is up 6% and it is the, among the top gainers on the Nifty in today's session. Back to you. Okay, all right, uh, Harmas, thank you very much for uh, that interesting breakup there on the holdings uh, across different Adani companies. By the way, I just want to